Uh, when we last left off, I was outside of Shinjuku. Uh, as you can tell, from things have changed a little bit. I fused a few demons. I have uh, a few more levels under my belt. Uh, so do Glenn and Hunter. We also have uh, Kanari, an Earthies, and Angel in the, in the lineup. Uh, Earthies is unique in that it is a elemental demon, uh, referred to in the game at the moment as Seireis. Important thing about this one, it can cast every status buff, just like a goblin, but if you use them in fusion, it kicks the fusion up a level or two. And by a level or two, I mean I'm able to fuse level 60 some odd demons right now. I can't get them, but they're there. <laughs> uh, Hunter has picked up Diorama and Mahazan, as well as Mapper. And Glynn is still devoid of any useful spells, but kicks a large amount of ass. Alright, north we go. Oh god, it's a full moon. Being north from Yoyogi. Oop. Sunky. Oh, auto. Both of these lead to the same place, but let's take a look at this. What's up here? That's an awfully red screen. Uh, this guy is apparently the... I guess would equate to the Secretary of Defense. Oh no. I mean, they look pretty foreboding in, like, you know, actual real life if somebody, you know, was painted red. Mm hmm. Oh no. I think we found the head of the Chaos Cult at the moment. He's only gonna give himself a carpal tunnel. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> the way with how frequently he's swapping hands there. Now he's not wrong. Uh, so for those of you who haven't played any uh, Shin Megami Tensei, Law is well, I'll put it this way: Law and Chaos are fascists and anarchists. Fairly certain that's an accurate way of putting it. The address continues. Let's get out of here. This seems eerily cultish. They yeah, usually have semi-decent points, but they push it to a way extreme. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm to the point of forsaking knowledge entirely in the law case and survival of the fittest in Chaos's case. Like in this, in the second game, it's Chaos is considerably more uh, amenable as. Law has been in power for like 60 years and they are doing some heinous shit. I've already activated the uh, terminal in this area. And taken the liberty of equipping us with some better stuff. Oh hey, Andrus. Die for me. God, that MP5 does work. Considering I don't have anyone who can hit multiple targets yet. The Lone Ghost! Yeah, that's another thing with these older ones, you know, waiting to get, like, group targeting. Yeah. I believe this is where I want to be, and we are going... <clears throat> this is a collection of three bars. And starting from top to bottom, they are the Law Bar, the Chaos Bar, and the Neutral Bar. We're going to the Neutral one. Because, one, because I don't like uh, law-aligned asshats, and two, I don't like chaos-aligned douchebags. But also because there's something important in this bar. Aside from a couple of andresses running around, like, goddamn, control your fucking clientele in here, man. Wait, is this the... 
get drunk, get kicked at a bar, immediately start fight. <laughs> oh god, the stalker's back. Stop following me! No, I don't want to have coffee with you. <laughs> Jesus! Everywhere I go, she's there! The fuck? Uh, no thanks. No, he doesn't want anything either. Nor does he! Yeah, I just want to chat. Oh, uh, yes, I have a demon summoning program. No, I don't think it's okay to let the demons run around unrestrained. Yes, I think it's wrong to call in a greater power to restore peace. Huh. You got a bar matchbook. Get out of here. Okay. I mean, I guess even with the, uh, the whole, uh, the cops are demons and zombies and shit, you gotta obey the law still. Can you burn down the bar? Uh, I can't burn down the bar, Glenn, I'm afraid. Damn. <laughs> I can't burn down the bar. <laughs> God, that was amazing. The one thing reigns supreme. That was the, the flame resistance of bar. Hey, hey, no, we've proven that sometimes you can burn down the bar. Oh, jeez, what was that game? I remember it. It was, <laughs> reason. It was stupid. Uh, that was Order of the Griffin. Or, ooh, Hunter's level is up. Late team. I should really be trying to get his health and strength up now that I've got his mag to 18. His stamina and strength. Uh, that was Order of the Griffin on the TurboGrafx-16, and that was one of my finest moments because I didn't... I thought if you, uh... <laughs> burned the entire bar down. If you burned the bar down, I th what I thought it would do is you just got caught, beaten, and robbed. Little did I know you could successfully burn down the bar. So now we need to go somewhere else. And then there was no inn to rest in. Yeah, that kind of sucked, but that was fixed soon enough. I just went outside and rested. Alright, from the neutral bar... We need to go downstairs. We're gonna hit turn east here and take a left. And oh, another ghost. Before we do that, we're gonna hit the uh, healer's dojo and get recovered. Also, I need to fuse some more uh, demons because now I'm level 18 and can handle some of the more powerful ones. Uh, goblin. Oh, that's a lot of goblins. Well. I also need to reacquire a Jack Frost for later. Ah, the series mascot. Mm-hmm. He hope. Like Pikachu. If Pikachu were a toothy mouthed ice demon. Mm -hmm. With a mouth on him as well, as I've discovered. Although that might just be due to the translation. Because what, if you uh, continue to laugh with them, they'll eventually ask you if you think you're hot shit and tell you to crush a rock between your hands. <laughs> Which uh, I was not prepared for, because that's supposed to be a kid-friendly mascot. Mm -hmm. Kid-friendly by the definition of Japan, once again. That, to be fair, the translation in English is usually a little bit more, air quotes, edgy. Because it's done by... Usually teenage, mid-teen to early adult Americans. Ah. Uh. Have anyone to revive? Oh yeah, this that guy who's been dying for a while. Over HP MP. Uh, the funny one of the funnier conversations I had was with a Sankey that asked me if I had any liquor on me. Uh, their default. Ah, it's a jack-o'-lantern. Their default personality is is uh, old man. Uh, okay. We're gonna wander around in here trying to get a Jack Frost because that is one third of a very important fusion. All right, I can't remember the exact combo for this one. I think it was Can was Canary and Sankey. I think it was. No, that's Bogle. Bogle. No, fuse two demons in the oddly phallic chambers. Uh, Canari and him? No, I don't even know what that is. Um, hmm. need to hold on to Angel. 
Imp and Sankey? What? No, that's what that's Mew. Uh, Mew is useful if you're dealing with anything that does force damage. Uh, hmm. Uh, I hope it wasn't Angel and uh, something else because I need Angel for something later. No, it. Oh uh, yeah, it was Angel. Uh, back out. We've got a lot of demons sitting around that I can't do a lot with. That will change very quickly, however. Just gonna eat him. Uh, let's try and recruit a body conian. Oh, damn it. Oh, damn. I'm hoping to get a, J a Jack Frost, because I need one. Uh, let's grab a Kobold. Friendly. Yeah, yeah. Smile. Sing. See ya. <laughs> That usually works! Damn it! Uh, oh! Ooh! Ooh! Friendly! Yes, keep laughing. Laugh back. Keep laughing. Damn it! That usually works! <laughs> oh! It didn't work that time. Ooh! Friendly! Laugh back. Keep laughing. Yes, it worked! Uh, make it your minion. 449 yen. Uh, 161 mag. Keep asking for things I've got plenty of. Jesus. Yes, there we go. We got a Jack Frost, we're good to go. It's uh, not Christmas time. Har har. I need to check how many I'm, I've got with me. Got one, two, and then one, two, three, four, five. I don't. I think I have room for one more. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna need to get. I'm gonna have to let something go. It's probably gonna be imp. Just I'll grab an Andrus or a Body Conian or something and fuse the two. Hey, Gecko. Yep, this is what Jack Frost is from. Oh god, slime. They're worth a ton of experience if you can get around their mountain of defense. Ideally, I want to get my party to, uh... Oh, there we go, there's an Andrus. Alright, asshole, what am I going to have to do? Oh god, this one. Lower your weapon. There we go. Magic stone, sure, take one. Yin, you got it. Okay, let's go ahead and fuse this thing. All right, let's see what you can get with a three demon fusion. Uh, Imp, Andrus, and fuck it, Sankey. Uh, that is a bit too powerful for me to use right now. <laughs> Shit. That is, uh, Orthrus. That is the lower level of Kerberos. Yeah. Who names these places? Uh, Greek, usually. It's from, like, all different kinds of, like, background Greek, Chinese, freaking ab Aboriginal. Mm-hmm. And of course, the version he's playing has all the categories in, like, glorious Japanese. So yes. you don't even know what the heck you're trying to find. Angel, li translate it. literally Angel, Angel, Fallen Angel, Andrus, uh, Neutral, Jack Frost, and Jack-O-Lantern. Uh, Fairy is the proper uh, translation. Yama, I forget. Uh, Maju, I don't remember. What happens when I combine these two? I could take new and then merge it with Andrus and see what I get. 
I mean, it's not bad. It's a good frontliner, given that it resists, uh... It resists slash and force damage really well. I, mean, I might as well. I'm not using those two, and I need to make space. And it will up the levels. Goodbye, old dude. Goodbye, him. And they're gone. What do we get? We get Wilder New. All right, let's continue the fusions. Uh, New does not play nicely with any of these, <clears throat> apparently. About Earthies, what do you produce? Slime. Fuck that. Oh, the worst. Yeah. But you uh, should throw it at people. <laughs> yeah, you'd think that. Question mark? Hello. Slime should be a ranged weapon in games. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Pick him up and throw. Funny, Slime's a terrible in this game, but if you, like, play the Dragon Quest Monsters game, Slime's make, like, some of the strongest monsters you can have. Mm-hmm. Whoa! Abaddon? Holy shit! <laughs> if only I could summon that! Well, we discovered the combo for Abaddon. Someone write that shit down. That is new... Uh, Andrus... And, uh... And a, uh... Fairy demon. Fuck me. How about new Andrus and Canari? What does that make? Oh, Absaris! Shit, I'm about... I'm gonna hold on to these because Absaris is really fucking good. Uh, Absaris and Ameno Azume make a hell of a combo. Damn. Apparently, I'm, I need to gain like four levels. And then I can start really kicking out good shit. We're gonna hold on to those for now. Okay. We should go. Now that, let's, now that we're uh, healed up, we're going to go downstairs to the second basement. Assuming I stop getting attacked. Oh, hey, Mahabufu Stone. Kobolds, kill him. Jesus! Fuck! I am I just going, like, one step to the next, passing by a, a conga line of jack-o'-lanterns and jack-frosts? I think I may need to up my luck. I'm not getting many drops. Stairs. Oh, Lord have mercy. I mean, we're not even fucking 30 minutes in and I've already ran into some amazing combos. <laughs> oh, a bunch of goblins. They're gonna get real swollen and die. I need to reset Glenn because he's uh, back to the sword instead of the gun. For whatever reason. But I want to cut things. Yeah, well, I need multi-target. You, you mean Earth a bayonet? Ammo, metal shin guards. Katana. Getting real So if, anime. if the bayonet is longer than the gun, is it a gun or a sword? <laughs> The gun blade. Yep, it's all good. Go on in. 
Oh, Fornius. Oh, shit. I want to recruit this. If I... Oh, no, I'm too low level to recruit it. Shit, they're not supposed to show up in this in numbers like this. Hello, Foxy. This is bad because they have Mahazanma. I probably need to bail because they will beat oh, my goodness. ass. Or not Mahazanma, but Mahazayo, which will uh, uh, put the shock status on you, so you lose your turn. Oh, that's obnoxious. It is. Yeah. So from here, the guard, and we keep south. This dude's eyes are, uh, this dude's face is a little bit, shall we, I believe the term that came up in Pokemon Vietnamese Crystal was messed. So we are taken to a room just behind there, to that car to that lady we met before in our dreams. It's Kaida. Help her again. There's some matter she wishes to discuss with us. The current region in Tokyo is summoning demons and using their power to try and create a world molded after his own ideals. Where have I heard this before? Thinking that, if left alone, he would become a threat, the ambassador, Thorman, has has convinced the American government to send troops into Japan to suppress the coup d'etat, and impose their will instead. Revolution for the revolution. Mm -hmm. Now, the worry is that if these two meet head-on, they'll reduce Tokyo to, to rubble, and it will become a war zone. That's never happened before. <laughs> While we can't stop the coup d'etat forces, we can destroy a gang of thugs led by a man named Ozawa. Oh, hey, the dudes who were kicking Glenn's ass earlier. Uh, apparently, the gang, that particular gang leader has struck a deal with the current regent and is basically being a goon squad. That's why I have no ass. It was all kicked out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, we will agree to help the resistance leader. However... Stalker time! And she teleports out. So as you may have gathered, Yuriko isn't on the up and up. Hang on, I gotta go make sure Jinty's gotten the, uh... notification. If he's not already... Traveling to uh, FWA. Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Oh, Fuck you, Twitter. Hmm. I, I I hit home to refresh the list. There was Carmine's post <clears throat> about the stream. I went to click it. And it went. Hold on, I'm gonna update the list right under your mouse cursor. I hate that. So the resistance members have flooded out of the resistance base. We need to move, and fast, because God knows where they've taken her. Yeah, we meet up at the bar in Shinjuku. So, what he does not tell you is you need to go to the bar in Shinjuku. Ha ha ha! Gamigan! Ah, it's spoiling <laughs> for a fight. The basement has... I punch it! The basement has different demons, and Glenn hits level 18. Uh... Another point of strength, another point of strength, uh, some speed, stamina. Oh god, speed will up accuracy on both counts, defense and evasion. Yes, please. Oh hey, kobolds, that's adorable. Everything into speed. 
Uh, no, I need to get your, uh, strength stat kicked up even higher, actually. There's a staircase up here. We need to go back to the no, neutral no bar. No strength, only speed. Just paint me blue. Call me Sonic. Sonic. No. <laughs> so now no. we come back to the bar where Stalker Woman was. Oh, hey, they just let jack-o'-lanterns walk around in here? Fucking hell. Have some decorum. I just imagine her, like, watching you sleeping, like, breathing like that one guy from Hey Arnold. You know the one. I was stalking Helga. Yeah, him? Yeah. The one that she always punches in the face? Yep. Yeah. Oh, hey, an orb. Alright, so we come back here. Uh, they're taking Ethel away to be executed. Or, sorry, Kaida away to be executed. Ethel was the previous game. Or, that's the previous save. They're going to publicly execute her in front of the Tokyo government office. Well, I know where we're going now. Right after we get back it's from the, uh... parking fine. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're gonna hit the Healer's Dojo real quick and then make our way there. Yeah, getting real military coup there. Just executing people out in the square. Out in the public square. Now, there's a reason I grabbed that jack-o'-lantern. Something, something. Bastille, something, something. <laughs> Alright. Before we go any further, let's go ahead and get HP MP recovered. Uh... Do you have any items I can buy? Soul Returner is useless. Hamaya, to my knowledge, is useless. Well, they're not useless, they're just not very useful. Um, the thing is, they cast basically a fairly inaccurate instant death spell. Nurai Statue, Amida Beads, Omikuji. Uh, none of these are terribly handy. We're going to hit the drugstore. Let me check how our uh, healing supplies look. Uh, one stack of magic stones, so two magic stones, two orbs, seven gyotans, or six gyotans, seven ointments. That should be enough healing for a while. All right. We're gonna go upstairs, zombie tocho, oh my god. I'm going to take a quick save state here, because this can go very wrong. Uh, on my first playthrough of this, I you're supposed to get attacked by four waves of enemies during while rescuing the heroine. I finished the second wave, and then the second wave spawned again. The second wave are zombie soldiers. And um, they have M16s against a bunch of punks. And one crazy guy with guns. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> they tore my ass up. They killed every demon I had. I went... I needed... What I needed was three motherfucker... Three assholes with wallets that said bad motherfucker. What I had was one dude with a, a wallet that said bad motherfucker. I had a, one dude with a wallet that said stupid motherfucker. And <clears throat> one dude with a wallet that said useless motherfucker. By the end of that, they had moved up several pants sizes and earned th two additional walls that said bad motherfucker. I'm not sure how I lived through that to this day. I think it was because I leveled up on the third wave, and it saved like half the, like two members of the party. Ah oh man, leveling up saving your ass. <laughs> yep. Balls deep in like a dungeon you're not supposed to be in for real. Mm -hmm. about death door. You can get level up and all your stuff is back. Yep, we are going to summon the jack o lantern because we need fire damage for this fight. Jack o lantern? Has... Yes, that's its name, jack o lantern. Does it moonwalk? Uh, no, it just sort of blows things up. It's not a very good jack o, is it? She oh shit, Dryad! <laughs> Talk. Those are those are fun. Uh, oh, we're gonna noises. save the game here. 
this can go really badly. No, because I desperately need this minion. Sure, you can have a magic stone. You can have all the mag you want. Yes! Oh, fucking A. Now I can summon- I can now fuse an extremely powerful demon off of, uh, Angel and Dryad. Uh, that is Ameno Uzume, who is level 16 and has stats like a level 21 monster- like a level 21 demon. Yay! Even, nah, man, even her sprite is different from what I'm used to. They change so much. Mm-hmm. Uh, Hunter now has Diorama, which is an extremely powerful healing spell. And that's gonna come in handy. I did not have that the last time I was coming through here. Alright, little fuckers. It's about time for the public execution to begin. You're awfully upbeat about that, sir. He finally has stable jo uh, a stable job. A huge mob of Goto soldiers, demons, and spectators gathered. Not much time. Glynn, in a moment of wisdom, informs him that if we uh, rush in there, we're going to get gunned down before we get within 200 feet. But you know, soldiers, M16s... Then again, we... why you bring rocket launchers. Continually opposing the plans of our great leader. <laughs> Has forgiven this woman. Uh, this is all Yuriko's doing, because she is a jealous, psychotic sl stalker. So this scene where they're all there in, like, this pan-out shot, and where one soldier is just out of line, just... Mm -hmm. Also, look at what they're wearing simple. now. Jesus Christ, what is that? <laughs> Hmm. So we start out with zombie cops. These are easy enough. Uh, Glenn's gonna gun these down, and Hunter's going to pull Mahazan. Uh, Kanari is not the most useful, but, uh... Agil <laughs> Battle thongs. The uniform of tomorrow! Uh, actually, Angel is going to cast... Uh, none of these will really help yet. No special abilities, so Angel's going to attack. And jack o lantern is going to cast Maha Aggie, which is going to shitwreck all of these because they're undead. Getting good damage in there, uh, but this is just the first wave. I cut down two of them with the, uh, Sunsets of Khan. Jesus! That hit like a truck. 174 damage! Yeah, that's pretty nice. Angel took 12 damage. Jack- Oh, no! Oh, Jesus, they are hitting the back rank, and I need them to stop. This is why I brought the Jack-O-Lantern. That's eight zombie cops, 56 experience. Oh, that can't... That wasn't too bad, right? Tons it of money, bunch better. of magnetite. Police brutality. Oh, shit, a new Nanbu. That is a very rare drop off zombie cops. It's kind of a crap pistol, though. Now we get zombie soldiers! <laughs> uh, my only option here is... Zombies with assault rifles and body armor. Yeah, this is great. Molotov Cocktail. The best route that I know of is Molotov Cocktail. Gun him down. Hunter is going to uh, heal up that jack-o'-lantern and hope he doesn't die. Uh, Kanari. See, usually when I come here, I've uh, picked up a Dryad so I can get Ame no Uzume and use her extra to charm all of these. Uh, I need Kanari to stay alive. Uh, we're going to do a Maidia, which will heal the party. And Jack O' Lantern's going to Maha Aggie. I mean, this to is... be fair, Foxy, it doesn't it doesn't take a lot of brain power to point that end at the bad guy and pull the trigger. <laughs> He's not wrong. We didn't say they were good. They were good shots. Oh Jesus! So these do a lot of low damage attacks. 
problem is there's eight of them. Ah, oh, yes, the death of a thousand pets. Yes. Oh no! Jack o' lantern's down! Shit! Oh. Well, you lost again. No, I haven't Sorry, lost, but now I have to rely on. The reason I wanted the jack o' lantern to get its turn first was because it will ice this entire wave. Oh god, that hurt. Oh yeah, you can tell that this is a Nintendo RPG. Okay, uh, I'm gonna throw another Molotov. Actually, I'm gonna sword these fuckers. Lynn is going to Maha Aggie, which is going to be a bit crappier because, yeah. Hunter is going to hit one with Zanma. Kanari will Aguilao, and we're getting another Maydia cast. Had this gone off earlier. Come on. Drop another one. Yes. Okay, healing. One, two, three. Okay, this is manageable now. The problem is M16's hit uh, two to six to... Here it is again! Shit! It's a fresh battle! Oh boy. Maha Aggie! Magic Maha Zan! More zombies! More mm -hmm. zombies! Magic Media! Oh god! It's like you jumped immediately into day seven of seven days to die. Mm hmm. She's giving their heads explode. It's like House of the Dead in here. Oh, God. Please take the big one. Yes. All right, my turn. Okay. Shut up. Oh, no, I only got one hit. Oh, stop killing my team. This is a known bug with the patch. Canary is fucked. Okay. Oh, shit. Fire and damnation. Another Maha Aggie out of Glynn. Uh, uh, Maha Zenma. Agarau and... Medea. Alright, this should kill off the rest of the wave. This is not supposed to happen, by the way. Oh, Jesus. Got 160 experience. Not bad. And now for four more zombie soldiers and a group of Lemures. Here we go. Oh, God. Remember when I said I needed three guys with wallets that said bad motherfucker? We're going to find out how many bad motherfuckers we got. Okay, the zombie, so zombie soldiers gotta go. Aha, Zan, those as well. Attack that. Heal! If I had an M if I had a said another MP5, this would be over in two turns, or in two attacks. Oh no, I don't need that Zon spell. Oh, stop casting that! Oh, stop! No, you were supposed to kill another one! When everything goes wrong... I mean, I'm not in... Mine. Oh, no. Okay, Kanari took another one out. <laughs> Glenn's going to gun down the Lemures, and Hunter is going to... Tiarama the Canari, so it doesn't die, because I need swinging power right now. And another Maydia. Oh, Jesus! Take the wheel! 
Kindness, you can always halfway count on, you know, Law Bro to, you know, save your bacon in the early game. Oh, fuck! Kill the other one! Okay. Just the Lemures now. <sighs> Actually, fuck sorting. I'm going to summon something. Get, getting you out here. <coughs> Gun. Uh. Fuck it, gun! Gunman with the power to gun. Like, I like to imagine that there's just been bursts upon bursts of non-stop automatic gunfire here. Yeah, considering the crowd, you know, some stray bullets probably hit some people too. There's probably like this absolute carnage out there. Yeah. Ow! Or better yet, if like a random bullet is struck a demon and the demon like went like bad shit crazy. Mm hmm. Would not be a fun time. Okay, we're about through the Lemures. Okay, Mew hits like a truck. Oh. 276 experience across the board. And lastly. Four Lemures and two Ghouls. The only thing Ghoul has that makes it a threat is the uh, Paralyzing Bite. Lemure, on the other hand, is an issue because it does large amounts of wind damage. Oh, well, Jesus, just like the Ghouls from Final Fantasy 1. Yep! Last castings of Maha Agi are going at the Lemures. Oh yeah, New has no spells. Uh, extra on the ghoul. <sighs> Somehow I have muddled through this. Ooh, I was hoping that glitch wasn't going to hit me again, but it did. Uh, Kinari is going to... Actually, fuck it, I can rattle the, the ghoul. Okay, everybody's HP is looking good now. Oh, there goes one Tokyo Ghoul. The whole team is less dead now. <laughs> okay. And from here on out, it's just bash the shit out of the Lemures before they kill somebody with Xan. Namely, Glenn or I. Jesus! It's okay, I didn't need those hit points. There goes the ghoul. Okay. We're down to auto territory. Holy shit! Uh. Yeah, you lost cheating bitch! <laughs> uh. Wait, are we gonna burn her at the fucking stake? In a public square. In modern times. Jesus, that's ghoulish. It's to send a message. Mm-hmm. Group is healed. Uh, let's go ahead and get one more, Maitia. There. Okay. People are less dead. Holy shit. Yes, we're leaving. Fuck.
Well, I apparently had three dudes with walls that say bad motherfucker on them. <sighs> People wonder why I grind as much as I do in the early game. That's fucking why. Everybody says, oh, this isn't that hard of a fight. I'm like, bullshit, it's not. These are people who are completely and totally blessed by RNG and like everything like shot what they were supposed to and not what they weren't. <laughs> so I just found out an interesting uh, gaming tidbit. Yeah. So you know how uh, various keyboards nowadays have lighting effects mm -hmm. and yeah. they interface with the game. So certain games give you certain lighting effects. Oh no. Far Cry 5. Uh, if you have a, a Corsair LED keyboard, turns your keyboard into the American flag. Oh, God. So, the good I thing about... I on general Discord. ...about Diorama is it... Because of how high Hunter's mag is, it will pretty much drop 60 to 70 HP of healing. Now, before we he go... Healed. Yeah, before we go meet up, we're gonna get healed at the dojo. All right, the Healer's Dojo, and then go take care of a side quest. I have been hankering for some revenge for a certain individual. Hi, Jack-o'-lantern. I... oh. Goodbye, Imp. Oh, are you gonna put everybody to sleep, you bitch? Oh, boy. God, I hate... Oh, nice. Things. Apparently Corsair has a lot of other effects. Uh, there's no loot for this one, Foxy. Just mag and experience. Apparently, if you're on fire, all of your devices, fans, uh, mouse pad, mouse, or keyboard that are Corsair and have the LED tech will flash as if they are on fire. That's Yellows and oranges. Terrifying. It's actually fucking cool. If you get slashed by a bear, it puts three red slash marks across your keyboard. Hmm. Oh, I went to the wrong side. This is all cool, man. I imagine this would make those bulbs, like, burn out like a... Oh, they're LEDs. Yeah, they're LEDs. LEDs don't fucking care. Mm -hmm. LEDs will last for fucking decades. Hmm. Fair point. It's one of their benefits. Well, they're, they're, they're very low. Most LEDs are freaking 7 watts or less. Mm -hmm. They barely channel enough electricity for it to matter. Yup. Alright, let's get the jack-o'-lantern on its... As Foxy said, they'll outlive us. Yeah, pretty much. Cover HP MP. Any vaguely quality LED will last <sighs> forever. I have no business in the Healer's Dojo. I do have business in the uh, Cathedral of Shadows, though. Oh, ho, it's time, it's time. Yeah, usually when an LED burns out, it wasn't the LED burning out, it was something else in the circuit. Angel and Dryad. Produces... on YouTube called Big Clive that uh, disassembles them. Ame no Uzume. Uh-oh. Uh, Ame no Uzume. 155 HP, 128 MP. Damn. It has Diorama, and its two abilities are Happy Song and Sexy Dance. <laughs> oh, sexy, wow. sexy Dance inflicts charm on an entire enemy group. Charmed enemies have a very high chance of attacking themselves. Nice. Yes, this is all right. Uh, you can also use any, uh, Tinshi family monster there, so... That'll work. You can also get away with Pixie if the, uh, demon is high enough level. It works just fine. There is Ame no Uzume. Damn it, uh, now I want a Corsair mouse pad. Uh, Megami Ame no Uzume, goddess Ame no Uzume. All right, we're gonna quick. We're gonna take a save state there because fuck yes. Now we've got other things to fuse. I'm level 18, so I should be able to handle. What happens if I combine Earthies and Ame no Uzume? Oh, they can't be fused. Huh? Is she Andras? Whoa! I wish! Jesus! All these powerhouses I can't fucking fuse! Agni, uh, of Agni and Rudra. 
the two gods of uh, the... I believe Agni is a Hindu god of fire? Can't recall. Let's try fusing three demons. Andrus, Mew... Yeah, I do believe, I do believe Agni is a uh, Hindu. Oh, wait. This was at... Whoa, werewolf. Uh, can't get him either. Claw, bite, and critical. Downside is when you hit extra, it will use any of those. Uh, fuse two demons. Let's try... Canari and, uh... Andres? What's that produce? Oh, Syak. No, thank you. Uh, try... Earthies and Andrus, maybe? Or does that produce something terrible? Whoa, that produces Flowros. Fucking, I can't do anything <clears throat> with this Earthies. <laughs> oh yeah, with him jumping things up with levels like that, it's just not gonna work for now. No, but it's good to have. I don't believe this system's in this game, but what was definitely fun in some of the later games was where, you know, um quote-unquote botched fusions they like gave yes. you like way more powerful stuff mm -hmm. what happens if I fuse those two oh yeah that's right that was Agni um no we're gonna fuse it's easy enough to get an earthies it's just the hard part is actually finding something you can make with it and still use it Slime, no thank you. As good as you have one at least, now you have it in your compendium for later on. When you actually have the money to actually use your compendium. Oh, do we do you have a compendium in this one? Oh wait. Can't remember. Try combining Maybe. those three. Lilim, I wouldn't mind that, but I'm not high enough level. Lullaby, Buffala, Charm. Damn. Alright, there's nothing I can really fuse right now. Unless I throw together some low-level stuff to get something else. I'm trying to hold on to the Jack Frost and Jack-O-Lantern for a reason that Marcus knows. I'm, me I'm missing one thing for a three-demon fusion. Oh boy, I know where that's going. Yeah! Uh, we'll try... I may just have to dismiss the Earthies, I don't know. It's just eating up space. Fuck it, we're, we're moving on. Jack Frost, Jack-O-Lantern, and lastly, Jack Ripper. Oh my. Collectively, they're the Jack Bros. Jack Bros. Oh boy. That sounds unfortunate. <laughs> I don't get it. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to educate me. Uh, that was a uh, it was a virtual boy game we didn't get in uh, the States. Ah. Alright, we're gonna go take care boy. of something now. This little building here. Not a lot of particular value in here, but uh, one of those but Ozawa's in here. 1300 Magnetite, however, is well worth it to the pit stop. All those odd consoles that are either completely forgotten or that we didn't get over here, like the Wonder Swan color. Oh god. I don't even remember the Wonder Swan. Hee ho. Be nice to my buddy. And Gamigan. Oh, he was a sh. Wow, he got chumped. Ooh, level 19. I can get some more stamina. I need to get my int up is the problem, because otherwise demon negotiation is going to be a bitch. Giggity. I... Wait, what? There were two... The ants go marching two by two, hurrah! Jesus! Oh, 
Uh, that is, Foxy, is because I can't use magic. Protagonist in the first two games actually was unable to do any form of spellcasting. His power was the tongue. Stabby, stabby. Which, as you find out later on, was for balancing reasons, and, we, and later on, it's how to just throw that out of the window. They're like, you know what? We don't need that. Actually, you want to actually be an actual mage? God, you can do that. There's a man standing here alone. You see, SMT3, also known as SMT Nocturne, gave you this wonderful protagonist named the Demi Fiend. Mm -hmm. Who, for supposedly being a half human, half demon construct by a plot, manages to be stronger than everything in the you know entire world because you know he's you know customizable. This is supposed to be a threatening fight, but uh, I'm way over leveled and I have people who can cast fire spells. So, so you're saying Marcus is a bad fanfic. He um. He's pretty damn strong. Like, he's a... <laughs> he's that god mode character that, you know, somebody throws into your RP that throws everything into, you know... Disarray. Disarray. Oh! Okay, he... Featuring Dante from Devil May Cry. Okay, skeleton Brazilian dancer. <laughs> okay, then! Uh, not what I was expecting, but alright. Is it... <laughs> <sighs> Too bony to be Brazilian. Let's see if we can connect, because an Agira will utterly end this thing. Oh, right, right, I almost forgot. Extra! Oh, no, it's Zanma. And it's dead. Got 144 yeah, XP. And it's gone. Hunters, level up. Mm, that 20 mag power and mag effect is tempting. Yeah, let's go with that. I to learn a new spell. Got 100 bucks. Got 36 magnetite. Ozawa disappeared. No one's here. That's that. That is the entirety of that side quest, by the way. You just come here to get a fuckload of mag. Ooh, dryad. <clears throat> I'm tempted to keep Dryad around as well. Nowadays, a side quest like that would charge you like would cost you like five dollars on the e store. Yeah. Ah, jeez, Fire Emblem. Mm-hmm. And now I've got a Dryad to work with. Much better. Fucking don't. So I played Fire Emblem uh, Awakening and. Mm -hmm. I understand now why people say that had pay-to-win elements. Um, yeah, you buy that. You you buy the DLC that gives you gold. You buy the DLC that um, gives you all the regalia, yeah. <clears throat> or the one that gives you levels. mad experience. Yeah, they kind of fucked that up. I mean, I really yeah, enjoy. Yeah, there's a DLC. There are two DLC quests specifically for the purpose the purpose of making grinding way easier. They give you these, you know, piss easy enemies to kill, and like in one of them, these enemies give you stupid amounts of EXP. <clears throat> in the other one, the enemies give you stupid amounts of gold. And they have, you know, pretty decent item drops. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's uh, a little bit fucked. Yeah, the gold one, the gold one is just complete game-breaking territory. However, more people more often than not bought the leveling DLC for a single character, and that character's name was Donald because Donald was terrible when he first came in. He's a peasant, but he had a really, really, really good skill unique to him. Doesn't it all he gained more stat ups or something? Yes, by like. Uh, Good man, like his like his base, his base wasn't terrible. And then when you pair it with base was like middle line, and you pair it with the fact that you know 
he's guaranteed, you know, points in like almost every stat every time he levels up. Oh, Jesus. Uh, you remember you were talking about Rizoka earlier? I might as well here. That's a decent demon for that level. Fucking A. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Riot and Kanari are now Risolka. Yeah, a lot of these are in the same, or in the exact same place as they are in some of the later games, so... I definitely, around this time, I definitely, you know, have, you know, <clears throat> an Archangel, a Rusalka. I don't know how to get Archangel, unfortunately, and I don't think I can make <clears throat> angels join me. Because I'm either too neutral or too chaotic. Yeah, and this one, <clears throat> and this one thing is, you know, what you can get is like... Tell me about you rank, we can do that. But in 4, which is where um, most of what I'm referring to, in 4, uh, certain demons can just oh. evolve at certain levels. Yeah, you, you mentioned Archangel. The Angel line being that Angel can go all the way up to something if you have the patience to just keep it as, like, that. I didn't realize Archangel was that powerful. Well, GT is way stronger in this game. Mm-hmm. I can allow, uh... Hanma... Jesus, that's the that's the, the accurate version of uh, Hama. And, damn. Yorama, I wish I could fuse him, but... Let's see, what do I need to do that? Fa uh, Rusulka and fa a Fallen Angel. Alright, then. New is sadly a bit of a dead end. Oh god, what happens when I put Earthies with Rusulka? Oh, Gandarva. Not very good, actually. Uh, three demons, then. New... Earthies... Andrus? God damn it, it produces slime. Fuck. And... Earthies and maybe Jack Frost, or if that or if that turn out something crazy, Goblin. Mm, no, 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 no! You will die. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> Some like Emperor Palpatine. Oh, I can get Angel back, but that would cost me two of the three. Alright, we're going to be a bit under-equipped for the moment. Let's summon ourselves our new friend, Rusulka. Another back row demon. Hey, Dan. Good of you to join us, finally. Okay, we are going to head back to the bar, which is where we're now... Holding up, since we can't use the basement anymore. Sounds about right for, you know, crazy demon field, you know, government takeover. Hide in the bar. Mm-hmm. Law bar, chaos usually, bar, neutral bar. It's a usually good place to be when, you know, things hit the fan. Oh, uh, when shit starts hitting the fan, it's not, not a bad place to be hiding. And you see, some of them now have a... It looks like they're dancing or they're thrusting their chest forward. That is charm status. Charm status makes you an... A, uh... What we say... Liability to your allies. <laughs> also, if I recall, charming a demon makes it easier to communicate with them. I believe I don't know. so. That sound, sounds like something I've heard before. All right. <clears throat> oh, jeez. Is Incubus in this one? Uh, I think so. I don't know if he has the giant uh, Incubus dong, though. <laughs> we, we all know what it is. <laughs> I mean... 
I know for a fact Dick Chariot is in this game. Oh, good old Penis Chariot, Mara. Oh, okay, dude. so now Wait. Hunter and Glenn are leaving the party. Bye. Bye. And now we have a small problem, because we can only have three demons at a time. And this presents an issue. The American Embassy is in Rapongi, and the other one is the, uh, uh, the coup d'etat forces are based out of Ichigaya, which means we've ready to fake ID card to get into Ichigaya. So here's the first thing I need to point out. Ka uh, Kaida? We haven't got to apply their stat ups, but oh my god, by some miracle, uh, their stats are actually passable. If you put her, if you put her to eight in everything, she will wind up at ten or eleven in everything, making her stats kind of useless. But if you've actually uh, spread the stat points out, it's re it doesn't do it doesn't hurt nearly as bad because each level is one point uh, into it'll go one point into strength, then one point into int, then one point into mag, then one point into spam. Basically, e trying to even out the stats. This isn't bad. All the healings, all the spells that uh, Hunter ha would have been useful with. Ooh, Makajama. And more importantly, Mahazayo, which is the AoE Zayo, which is evil. Uh, we're gonna do... So there's one thing I'm gonna take care of here and now. So I'm gonna save state real quick. This game is bugged. Uh, this English patch is bugged. <laughs> Uh, as we've no doubt determined from the 16 zombie soldiers I had to kill in one wave. What I'm going to activate is a PAR that gives me an MP5 and nerve bullets in, a, in my inventory. Now the reason for this is, ordinarily at this point, I should be able to go back to, uh, to Kichijoji and go to the mall, and the antiques dealer will now be selling guns and ammo. Uh, however, because of how the game is patched, I never- I do not have that option ever. Which is a giant problem. <laughs> so what we're going to do is, is- is equip myself with an MP5 and nerve bullets. If you- if you're curious, the new Nambu has less power and is less accurate. Now we're going to exit that screen. I'm going to save the game. And I'm going to turn that cheat off so that those are no longer there infinitely. It gums up your inventory and it uh, fucks with stuff. Get do another save state right here. Were this not a bugged patch, I would not be doing this. Let's go check our items. Equip me. Carmine. And it's gone. And it's gone. So we need to stock up on supplies before we go do this. Uh, we, we're gonna auto our way through this, by the way. Ameno Uzume and Rusulka make this much simpler. Damn, that was a happy song, not a uh, sexy dance, unfortunately. Now, the good thing about nerf bullets is they put enemies to sleep. Uh, this is to say nothing of when we get to magic shells, or as they're known in later games, randy shells. Why are they called that? Well, they, they inflict charm status on anything you shoot. Make you a little randy. Mm -hmm. I suppose sexy bullets wouldn't have had quite the same effect. Oh, Jesus, no. <laughs> it's, a little, it's a little dancing girl as it flies through the air. So we need to go to the drugstore real quick. The bullet has a cocktail dress on. I was going to say the bullet, the bullet has a condom on. Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. No, Moonies! So, will they make those rubber bullets? 
<laughs> Definitely not shooting blanks. <laughs> oh no! Every bullet is etched with high grade porn. Oh my Christ. Some fertile this... killing fields. <laughs> I've made it very clear that this is this is an adult stream. This is a mature stream. You're not you can't bring Can't pull hold that against me. <laughs> something, I mean, something, I mean, something I mean, something I mean, something. I mean just this is like also, I'd like to point out I'm pawning smoke bombs and Molotov cocktails at a drugstore. Seems legit. Which, which brings me to a point I meant to make earlier in the, in the last, um, uh, uh, in yesterday's stream, um, that a game like this meant to even get on a Nintendo console. Mm-hmm. What an achievement. Yep. And we're going to sell happens. all three of these Sun Setsu Kones. Uh, we might get lucky and get a, um, get the Meito Katana off of, uh, Goto. I got that in my last game, but I will probably not get it here, even if I have high luck. Are right, you were saying, Marcus? <clears throat> no, I was going to say, but Atlas knows how to, like, get their gang to where they, you know, where people want them to be. How the fuck did Eternal Darkness happen? Yeah. All right. I like- okay, I want to point out this drugstore is buying a restricted pistol <laughs> off of me. Okay, I think that's all I can sell here. Okay, that's it. That's Metal Crown, not what you think. Alright, we're gonna pack up- we're gonna max out on, uh, healing supplies here. We're also gonna pick up a couple of muscle drinks. Expensive as hell, but very handy. The, si w the side effects are that you can go over your maximum hit points, which is hilarious. That's it. Alright, let's get going. Oh. Steroids for beneficial effects? Yes. Somehow. So, Kaiden did not heal quite as well as Hunter did, but still pretty good. It's passable. I would prefer to have a Momonofu at the moment, but I can't fuse that. It is... Let me check what level I am. Am I 20 yet? No, it is four levels above me. And we would not get there in any reasonable time frame. Alright, let's get moving. We're going upstairs. We are first going to go to the Tokyo government office. Or sorry, to Goto's headquarters. Now there's some good stuff in here in a form of a luck incense and 8,000 yen. There's also, uh, f I believe Fallen Fornius is in here, and I can now recruit him, which means... Uh, let me go ahead and dismiss... I'm just gonna have to dismiss Earthies, because I have no use for it. It's not terribly hard to, to uh, use that again either way. We're going to head all the way to the east, and that big yellow building is Goto's headquarters. First thing we're going to do is meet with Goto. Place is off limits to civilians. Go back. What? You got an ID card? Okay, then you're clear. Go on in. You know, how would they not notice that uh, one of us, that the both of us were just involved in a giant dust up? You know, with fucking armed forces? I know they look green, but imagine them, you know, in white with black visors, and then you'll understand why. God. 
stormtroopers and all their knockoffs and variants are stupid. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when all your clones die. Oh, you guys are the dregs. I have no idea what the happy status does. Whoops, I took the wrong path there. Uh, the encounter rate in here is off the charts, by the way. Oh, jeez. Two steps and then a fight. Yep. I, you know, ooh, boy. The Fine. XP is good, though. I mean, it's not as obnoxious as some of the later dungeons. We're gonna go up to the second floor, because there's some good stuff there. And before we leave, we're going to take care of something in the basement. Assuming I don't get jumped by what I did in the first time, the first area, which was a, su a suicide squad of five, six zombie soldiers, and another suicide squad of five. Yeah, that was not fun. Uh, this room has the yin in it. Ooh, Fornius. Friendly. Or your weapon. Damn it. Corneus attacks. Okay, I take some damage. Let's try this again. I'm saving here because I've seen Corneus all of two times in Goto's headquarters now. God damn it. Well, we're going back. Friendly. Shit. Or your weapon. Ignore it. <laughs> Am I not smart enough? Threatening. Up the challenge. God damn it. Oh! <laughs> A round of defense. Threatening. Approach it. Flower. Approach it. God... <laughs> God damn it! Is that one just not winnable? Well, uh, you're once more caught in the next of the bar bait RNG. Intimidate. You can see why I want him. He hits like a fucking truck. Threatening. Intimidate. Flower. Uh, we should to join me or else make it I see. Mock it. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna save here and try. See what each one does. Calm it down. Okay. Let's try mocking it. For joke. No. Okay, I can't possibly get this. Uh, I don't think my int's high enough. Which is unfortunate. Stupidity kills. Yeah, kinda. <laughs> I'll have to come back here when I'm not stupid and try to recruit it. Oh, the other end here is Luck Incense. There's Gamagan. Shades? I haven't seen those in a while. Wait. Okay, 
say no, that's not what I thought it was. Oh, found a Disparalyze. It's rare. There's one other demon I'm on the lookout for, and that is, uh, Haunt Ghoul. Or, that should be Haunt Ghoul, I suppose. Alright, that upped my luck a point. Alright, on to Goto. You go inside. Wow, there's usually like five fights leading up to him. Oh, Jesus, put pants on, you schmuck! Fucking. Uh... No pants. Yeah, I guess you were fucking Goto by the fucking flat top and the pantsless fake fucking outfit. Ah! No pants. So he claims that the execution was entirely his subordinate's idea, which I believe him on. Because, technically, Yuriko is his, one of his subordinates. Oh, rockin' the fun Fundoshi. Uh-huh. Yeah, apparently he's been busy with more important matters. A plan being carried out behind the scenes. The plan is to create the Thousand-Year Kingdom in the name of God. Where else have I heard about Thousand-Year Things? Thousand-year things. Glenn, where have you heard about thousand-year things? <coughs> Sorry, what? That, well, those... No, that, that, that fine gentleman there in the shades and that... the pencil mustache, that's just fear. <laughs> there's, there's no Hitler here. The basic idea is that those that live so... in the kingdom will be... So, so... In Hearts of Iron, if Germany loses World War II mm -hmm. and Argentina goes fascist, <laughs> suddenly Argentina will get a new leader called Hadolf Etler. Oh, what? Who has sunglasses, a hat, and is clean shaven. No. <laughs> but is literally, literally the Hitler model that they used. Right. So, uh, anyone who is not sufficiently blind enough, uh, or who will not follow God blindly enough, will be killed at the uh, hands of the American army. And at the moment, oh, there are nuclear nice. the nu there are nuclear missiles pointed at Japan. There is a demonic force field keeping that from uh, blowing everything up. I take it back. He's called Senior Hitler. God. That so works. He, so he does not force us to go this path yet. Oh my god. Senor Hilter. Or Hilter, yes. Argentine League, no faction. Senor Hilter. Fascist, no elections. God almighty. Yeah, he's apparently one of the secret uh, leaders you can get in the game. It's terrible and hilarious. Uh, okay. So, if we came back here and talked to him again immediately, that would lock us into the chaos path. Auto. Oh, that was quick. I don't know what where Gamagan is from. I believe that's Welsh. So, that said, this is another good spot to hang around and level up. Oh wait, that's the stairs. I don't want the stairs. I want the elevator. That's across the hall. Okay, Azumis can kick your ass because there it is. Maha Zayo. However... When three of them get charmed and start beating their own asses, uh, less trouble. Nuclear, I don't know your, I don't know your 
They're on Yuki. They're on Yuki. They're on Nori's channel. Uh, that is Kone. Oh. K O N. What? They're Con. on Con. Yes, Con Cone something. Uh, let's heal up New. New is getting to be a. I probably should have let New go in hindsight. Ah, uh, this is a Suicide Squad. Um, yeah, they've got katanas and nothing else. They're also wearing armbands. And now they're mostly dead, because they apparently didn't have Kevlar vests. That, that would be something I think you'd want to equip a, uh, a, you know, a suicidal assault squad with. But that's just me. It doesn't really help them if they suicide too early. We're going down to basement 1F. We need to free some people. You remember how they were looking for all the different kaidas? Or, sorry, in this case, kaides? Yeah, we've got to let them out. This doesn't affect your alignment in any way. But it's something worth doing, in my opinion. Nobody's here. Group of guards chased him off before he was able to get us out. Uh, this does not bring Chaos he or Law Hero back, even if you do this, so keep that in mind. Now, there's only three people down here, to my knowledge. And that's the third one. We'll check down here just to be sure. For all the good it's going to do. Wait, what? Pull up the mapper there. Now, if I recall, those are the three that are down here, and that's it. Like, there weren't that many kidnappings, apparently. Fucking Christ, three battles in one spot. This is why I wanted that MP5. <laughs> You kind of need it. All right, back to the first floor. Let's get out of here. All right. So, not fucking three blocks away is the American Embassy, by the way. So from here, we walk south, we keep that on that path. Yeah, yeah, I know I'm clear. You waved me through already. So you see this yellow building? This is the uh, underground access to the uh, American Embassy. Oh, Spar Toys. These can be a decent demon. I don't usually keep them around. Mostly because they're... While they're somewhat resistant to Slash, they are incredibly vulnerable to Gun, which a lot of enemies will use. Oh, hey, orcs. Time to gun them down. 
Oh, good. All of them were charmed. So the ones that I don't gun down will probably kill each other. Yep. That's hilarious. <laughs> that was 455 fucking experience points, which I will gladly take. That puts me up to level 20. Let's get our int up, because I need to be able to negotiate with Fornius. Oh, hey, Dryad. Uh, I... Auto. Especially since I've got the advantage. Like, I don't want to go all in on having just Marin Karin demons. Uh, it's decent. Stamina can be boosted. Uh, speed's decent. The speed would be nice. For God, her defense is insane. Okay, so this is all in italics because he doesn't really speak Japanese that well. This place off limits. Oh, you have ID card. Go on inside. <laughs> yeah, apparently all you need to get in here is an ID, so, um... Oh, hey, Angel. I can try talking to Angel, but, yeah, so I am neutral or I am chaos right now. Uh, Angel refuses to listen to you. That is because I am not lawful, I think. There is no real way to check your alignment this early. This is the first floor of the embassy. Uh, there are three items that I'm going to get here. And coming out of the basement. We have a collection of orcs. Oh no. As you can see, I kick a lot of ass this early. That will change. <laughs> oh, that will change. Oh, jeez. This could be rough. They actually might get turns. Never mind. No, they're not. The advantages of a high speed. So in here is Luck Incense. Fashan as well. I have no idea what this is supposed to be, but, uh, it hops around. <clears throat> 357 experience, I'll take that. Like, if you also, another, an even better place to level up is the American Embassy, because shit's fairly powerful in here. Oh yeah, that reminds me. More luck! What does that leave my stats looking like? Pretty good, all things considered. Something, something. High school student gunned down American Embassy. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. In Japan. No. No. <laughs> no, it's not what you think. No. Please, no! Oh, I have to get caught up and see what's happening here. Oh. Okay. Now, in here is uh, Magic Incense, which I actually need to get my... At a certain point in the game, I need to have a high mag score. It's basically just a stat dump to get access to nice equipment. You can alternatively... Oh, Harpy. This is a rare appearance. It's a flight demon, which I don't really need. The signature thing for flight demons is they have an amazing weakness to uh, gun-type attacks. They're also extra annoying. Just how bad does it have to be suck? How does it suck to be born the demon weak to guns? 
gotta be kind of shit, not gonna lie. Like, you know, back in your heyday, you could have been, like, a badass who had people, like, sacrificing, like, their virgin daughters for you, but then, like, you know, any toddler with a six-piece can, like, off you. So, I suppose it's... Oh. Oh no. Oh, this is Beast K uh, Kushi. <clears throat> it is an adorable hound looking thing that will talk a mountain of shit at you. Uh, we're going to drop them because I don't think I can recruit them. They are law aligned. Alternatively. Mm. Oh, I. a way better fight than what they have now. I think I know why I am not able to uh, recruit angels. If you're not lawful, you can't gain access to that entire tree because they're light. You can only recruit neutral element, uh, neutral, in regards to light and dark there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're like all the way in like light, mm -hmm. lawful. Oh, Jesus. So that weird attack that looks like two charms were thrown at me, that is Hama. And Hama is instant death. I believe humans are immune to it. Oh, hey, a level up. Shit, yes. Uh, give me another point to int. Hell, at this rate, I'll be able to... I may come back, stick around here off screen and hit 24 so I can fuse a Momonofu. Who is an excellent frontline demon, and I need... One that isn't new. I mean, new hits hard, it's just... He's not very good. Alright, stairs up. Going to the second floor. Alright, there's not much to do here. In this room, there is an emerald, and in the next room on the uh, other end of the hall is a small, is about 8,000 yen, maybe nine. Or sorry, six, that to six or seven. And now we're gonna go have a word with the American ambassador. Get out of the way, sir, I have an appointment. All right, we will go inside. This is Ambassador Thorman. Uh, he apologizes his Japanese isn't very good and he hopes we can understand him. He wants to give us a big welcome. Uh, he wants to, they wanted to bring out the American army to save everyone from the demons, but they're not very strong yet. Uh, he, and apparently Goto is planning to summon fucking Lucifer to Tokyo. Hmm. Yeah, so the plot thickens. <clears throat> now, they want to bring peace back to Tokyo, which I don't believe. Uh, I do not want to hear that story again. <laughs> Will I hear his plea? No. But no, I don't think it's all right to just let Goto continue. So this has locked us into the neutral path. We're going to avoid taking sides for now. Otto. So we have a bit of a quandary now. As such, we're going to take care of something. Uh, we're going to kill... Uh, since we're walking the neutral path, we're going to kill both Goto and Thor. Man. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I let that slip? <laughs> Did anyone not catch that one? Ambassador Thorman. As opposed to Ambassador Thurman. <laughs> yeah, that's Thor, by the way. We're going to kick his ass like it's no... We're, we're going to stomp him on Otto. We'll put it th that way. Let's go ahead and get kind of more stamina for some more hit points.
Not America, not Japan. You just joined the USSR. <laughs> Is that our neutral point? Uh, technically, I the guess. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna. I'm not going saying one way or the other. Uh, I could go for the. There's a treasure in the room opposite the uh, luck incense, but it's just an ointment. So yeah, no. Oh wow, I'm up to two stacks of magic stones. I need to start using those. If I had any reason to, I sadly kicked too much ass. It would seem. I'm not gonna lie. 124 hit points. Taking things down left, right, and center. I feel pretty good. <clears throat> I feel good about our odds of taking on Godo and Thorman. Oh good, we caught the Dryads off guard. Uh, speed is what determines your chances of getting caught enemy off guard. By the way, it's pretty important. Jesus, how many magic stones am I up to? One stack, two stacks, almost a third stack. Here I thought I would need healing items. Good job. Be careful, uh, buddy. You think you can give me a uh, give me a hand with these orcs? I mean, you, I'm sh well. He may not be armed. He didn't seem to be armed there. So I just gunned down a pack of orcs, and their buddies turned around like, "Oh shit!" and got gunned down. And what was that noise? Fuck! Jesus, 135 uh, mag off those. There is one weapon that would be better if I cannot get uh, the katana off Goto, and that is off of the Spartoi here. They can drop a Gladius. God, those are worth a lot of experience. Okay, there's an exit here. Alright, first things first. We're gonna go deal with Goto. Because if I were to deal with Thorman first, it would set off an event that I cannot stop and lock me in the chaos path. Which, while that would be beneficial, I do not want. Yeah, they always make chaos hard to refuse. Like, right. games in general make being bad so much easier than everything else. And more fun. Mm-hmm. All uh, right. Hence the infamous games. <laughs> oh, that's one soldier dealt with. I'd be worried about how much mag I have, but I'm getting it in the, like the hundreds already. Already, I've got what three thousand of it. It caps at ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. All right, it's time to deal with Goto. We're gonna see if I get lucky and get the uh, the Metal Katana. Unlikely, but it's possible. Also, this is the first legitimately threatening boss, I would like to point out. We're going to take a save state here and make sure everyone's capped out on HP. These up some of these fucking magic stones. Jesus. So a magic stone restores one quarter of your maximum hit points, so it varies in healing by individual, but four stones will heal you to the max. Okay... Will you help me? Fuck no! <laughs> Take care of them. Oh no! Pishasha and New Auto. Bye, Pishasha. And... Goodbye, New. Is that all you got? Oh. Fucker, I killed Ozawa had one of these. The other one's a fucking pushover. This is the best you've got? Shit, 
dude. The critical hit hurt, I will say that. Oh, both those critical hits hurt. That is bad for Nyu and Rusulka. Put pants on, man! Oh, god damn it! Okay. Alright, we're gonna play this game, are we? <sighs> Extra. Amenozume is going to. Extra. Rusoka is going to Marin Karin. Actually, Rusoka moves faster than Kite. No, Kite moves faster than Rusoka. Uh, Marin Karin and Diorama. There we go. Oh, shit. Bind. No, you fuck! Yes! And this fight is over. You think I'm joking, but I'm not. <laughs> uh, where's that Dispara? Oh no, he's been empowered by the removal of his clothing. Oh no. <clears throat> he has been blessed with the, with the Fundoshi Force. God damn it. And he's hitting himself with that katana. Uh, I don't have access to Amino Uzume or Kaida, but that's not a big deal. <clears throat> Let's try gunning him. He's not wearing any body armor, so, uh... Yeah, they try to pull some bullshit like he's resisting the bullets while wearing nothing but a, you know, Japanese man thong. <laughs> <laughs> Japanese man thong is the name of my punk, bo punk band, by the way. Uh, we're playing at uh, Kichijoji next week. Nudity makes you stronger on this planet. No! What? Oh boy, he totally has a katana in his hand, guys. He's resistant to bullets because he's cutting it like a samurai. <laughs> a true samurai. <laughs> the only thing that uh, has... The only reason this fight's been extended was that fucking paralysis. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure we can just auto here. And, yeah, we're gonna auto him to death. Well, that was quick. 896 XP, thank you. Come on, Mato Katana! Damn it! Fuck! I was hoping to get the Mato Katana off of him. Oh, well. I could do that fight again, but I don't want to. Oh wow, I should heal new. Oh, Harry, there's level 22. Uh, 19 int means I can negotiate with just about anything up until mid-game, I think. Well, we've dealt with Gato, or with Goto, Goto, Gato, however you pronounce that shit. Whew. Dodge! Okay. <clears throat> As we've determined, I am the master of brute force here, so, uh, upstairs! I don't want stairs, I want elevator! Stairs, I gotta climb a whole other floor! Hmm. So, Ka. it is very important when cooking ramen in a microwave. Put water in the put bowl? water in the bowl. Oh. My roommate forgot this stuff. Straight up ramen. Fire bad! In the bowl. With the, no with water. The pack. With nothing else. And, and no water. Oh, oh. I commented too, I was cooking, I'm like, huh, your ramen is exploding. Oh no, we lost new. Nothing of value was lost. That's pretty old. <clears throat> Why 
she using the sword? She should be using the gun. I'm not remembering what else I wanted to, you know, mention. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if you knew about this. But the Shin Megami Tensei series used to have an MMO. It actually only recently ended. Imagine. Yeah. You do know about it. Yep. So you know, you know, and imagine guns are also very powerful. They have like some of the most powerful builds. But the one downside is that in imagine guns, you know, take bullets that you have to buy. Oh no. That. Hmm. I Which see. makes leveling up difficult because um, <clears throat> that game kind of works like FF5 oh, and like no. what you do oh, no. raises up levels of uh, certain things. So to raise up your gun skill, you gotta shoot it a lot. Like, yeah, so you basically buy cheap bullets and spam them and spam them in the training area. Oh, God. There's this one infamous build in Imagine called Survival Gunner, <clears throat> in which you have mild self-healing, uh, about midline armor, and high gunning. Uh -huh. And so, you basically, it allows you to easily solo as a gunner because anytime you get, any, it takes you a while to get low enough to need to heal. Mm -hmm. And once you get, you know, low enough need to heal, you can move away, heal yourself, and then, like, you know, still be in range to attack until the thing, you know, catches back up to you. That was slightly broken, not gonna lie. It took a while to get it, but it's quite, because, I mean, again, you're, like, you're, doing, you're spamming things so you know, make it level, but once you get it there, All it's right. pretty cake. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and... Wow, I dropped 12,000 frames over this stream. wonder why. Yeesh. Uh, is this the Heatler's Dojo? Yes. Yeah, yeah, I want to recover HP and MP. Oh yeah, I should probably revive Mew. God, that's 2,200 yen. Alright, I think this is a good stopping point, because I'm going to go get to level 24 so I can get a uh, Momonofu. Or what's about to come up. Uh, I won't spoil anything, but uh, let's just say the <coughs> next what? part of the game is a bit rough. Especially if you're not sufficiently uh, high level and demoned up. I'd like to thank everybody for coming out, and I'd like to thank my commentators for joining me. I'm gonna head out for the time being. I'll see you around. Bye, everybody! Bye.